Hi world, happy Friday, how are you? I wanted to come to you. Oh, why I look like my eye got a black eye? Okay, so I wanted to come to you and talk to you about the quality of hair. I am finding out that we are always supporting other cultures. We don't support our cultures. So we are going to different Chinese stores and buying these Chinese hairs. Uh, I call it Chinese hairs because a lot of times they get it from China. And when they get it from China, the quality of the hair is horrible. Horrible to the point where it's always tangling. It's always melting on a curling iron. Um, it don't match, match your texture. So then you come across these other types of hair that you have Peruvian, you have Brazilian, you have Malaysian that does match the texture of our hair even still and yet you still have to try to find the good quality of hair to that you can continue to invest in i rather y'all invest in a malaysian a peruvian a brazilian type of hair instead of go to these chinese stores and get these cheap hair when they say it's all human hair when in actuality it's not it's melting on your curling iron and then you want this cute style you want layers I can't cut a layer into that. How am I supposed to cut a layer into a hair that is so limp that when you curl it, it don't even curl? But yet, they charge you $100 per bundle and tell you, and because they telling you by their mouth that it's human hair, you buy it, you purchase it. Not only that, when you purchase it, you can't return it. You can't even get your money back on it. You can't even get a store credit at some places. So you're wasting your money and then you complain because you feel like these other types of hair are so expensive. But still, and yet, you'd rather go to the Chinese store and buy a quality because they told you that it was human hair. So, but us people, are, us black people, majority of us always get different types of hair. They banking off of us. And I'm trying to figure out why we don't support our own people. Why we don't go to our people and buy hair from from them knowing they can tell us the truth now you might have some people that would tell you oh this is human hair and it's crap it smell like corn chips it smell like feet yeah that they will feed you that bottom hair but it's up to you to know what you what you getting into it's up to you to educate yourself so you can waste stop wasting your money on bull crap now you can find out you can tell the texture of the hair if it's kind of soft you know if, if you if you pulling on it because a lot of places you go they won't let you touch it at all they won't let you take because they say that oh you will loosen the quality of the hair you mess up the quality of the hair if i'm touching it and you say that it messes up the quality of the hair by me touching it and pull on it it ain't good quality because you can tuck you can you can tug it you can color it you can uh put heat on pure indian hair and it will real revert back to its natural state this hair that i have in my head i have had this hair for three years i had a good distributor out of dc i can no longer find that distributor but i have had this hair for three years all i do is wash it and i just washed it as you can see and i i put scrunch it up and reuse it three years i don't have to buy no hair but i buy hair to test out different types of hair, uh, hair from different people before I use it on my client's hair. I don't like for my clients to use just any kind of hair. Now, if you bring some hair, I'll put it in. I'll sew down some hair, honey. I'll sew down pubic hair. Whatever kind of hair you bring to me, I'm going to sew that bad boy down. Now, if it don't turn out right and I can't cut it right, I'm going to let you know this ain't right. You, <laughs> This is the type of hair you chose to, to, to pick. But i rather you invest. Invest your money and stop wasting your money. This is a billion dollar business. They are making billions of dollars off of black women all day long. And the hair is coming from China. Chinese people are banking on us. They make electronics. They make hair. They make clothes. How many, how many of us can go to different countries and find different products made from America. Seriously, like, come on now. We don't support each other at all and be quick to down each other, talk about each other, but yet you supporting another culture all day long. So know what you buying. 
Educate yourself. Know the quality that you get because all the Chinese places that you are going to is not good quality hair. It is straight up booty. And you heard it from me. Peace out.